A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Mark. When the Pharisees with some scribes who had come from Jerusalem gathered around Jesus, they observed that some of his disciples ate their meals unclean, that is, unwashed hands. For the Pharisees, and in fact all Jews, do not eat without carefully washing their hands, keeping the tradition of the elders. And on coming from the marketplace, they do not eat without purifying themselves. And there are many other things that they have traditionally observed, the purification of cups and jugs and cuttles and beds. So the Pharisees and scribes questioned him, Why do your disciples not follow the tradition of the elders, but instead eat a meal with unclean hands? He responded, Well did Isaiah prophesy about you hypocrites, as it is written, These people honors me with their lips, but their hearts are far from me. In vain do they worship me, teaching as doctrines human precepts. You disregard God's commandment but cling to human tradition. He went on to say, How well you have set aside the commandment of God in order to uphold your tradition. For Moses said, Honor your father and your mother, and whoever curses father or mother shall die. Yet you say, If someone says to father or mother, Any support you might have had for me is korban, meaning dedicated to God. You allow him to do nothing more for his father or mother. You nullify the word of God in favor of your tradition that you have handed on, and you do many such things. The Gospel of the Lord To uphold your tradition, the Pharisees and the scribes from Jerusalem speak of the tradition of the elders, which for them is being neglected by the disciples. Indirectly, Jesus is being seen as party to this negligence. What they refer to is a set of practice defined, maintained, and practiced by the religious elite, including the Pharisees. In their zeal for their tradition, they forget what is at the heart of the law of God. When they neglect mercy and love in view of observance that has mainly to do with ritual purity, then they may be clean outside, but their hearts are filled with thoughts and acts that really defile a person.